Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing great. In today's video, I will tell you about how you can create Canva slideshow video if you are a beginner. So now, let's get started. First of all, you have to open your Google account and from there you have to open your Canva account. And by opening your Canva account, you must should be logged in. And now, you can see there is written presentation, so click on it. It's taking a bit time, so you have to wait. Alright, the file is opened now. First of all, click on the duration for setting it in the video frame. As you can see, it is in the video frame. Okay, now click on elements and type an image to get the image. You can get any image you want. I'm writing animals here. Okay. Now click on photos and from there I will choose some photos for my slideshow. Let's take this picture. Okay, now you can adjust the image according to your interest. I'm adjusting it. Okay, now click on add new page and now I'm adding another image. You can adjust it according to your interest. Okay, now add another page. Okay, now I'm using this rabbit's picture. Now I will add another page. You can also add videos as well. As you can see, I will add some videos. I will choose this penguin's video. Okay, now we'll adjust it according to the page. Okay, it's adjusted and look how cool it looks all right. You can also add page by clicking on this plus icon and I will add another video. Okay, I have added it and now I'm adjusting it. How cool it looks. Okay, it's adjusted. Now I want to add some more animations here. So I will bring this image to the center and I will change its opacity to the light. Let me do it. Click on transparency and I will load the transparency of it. And now I will copy this image. Copy. All right. Now paste it. Okay. First, it's asking for permission, so allow it. Okay, it's pasted now. Now, I will increase its opacity to 100. All right. Now, I will squeeze the size. And I have placed this image. Look how beautiful it looks. And I will group these pictures. As you can see, every page has its own duration. Some has 4 seconds, some has five seconds so i want to make all of this equal seconds here i'm listing this page to three seconds and from here i will apply it to all pages that's how all pages are of three seconds now next you can add animations as well so i'm clicking on this icon you can add dissolve, slide, line swipe, color swipe, circle swipe, and many more others. As you can see, there are so many, so you can choose whatever you like. I will choose the slide. Yep, I will choose the slide. Okay, you can also select the directions. I will choose this. And for the next page, I will choose the next and next directions. Okay, for the third one. Slide. And then this upwards direction. And for the fourth one, again, I will choose slide and the downwards direction. Okay. 
the transformation is added. Now you can see how beautiful it looks. Okay, you can also add music to it. And you can also add animations that I'm also adding an animation for pan for you. Or maybe pop up. Yeah, I will increase the speed. Or maybe decrease it. Okay. And I will also add animation in the tiger's picture. Yeah, this one looks cool. Let me decrease the intensity. Okay, and for the first picture, I'll also animate it. Let's go with this. Okay, that's done. Now, I can, you can add music to it as well. So, by choosing the music, you have to scroll down here and here, little audio. You can also select any music you want for this video. So, I will, let's say, choose this one particularly. Okay, you can adjust it from where you want to start the music or from where you want to end the music. And that's how you can make the slideshow according to your topic and according to your interest. And when you are done, you can simply download it. Click on the share button and scroll it down. And now click on the download button. You can download it in a PDF form or a video form or PNG form. As you can see, there are so many options. One is PDF and PPTX, video, GPGP, and SVG. There are so many options, so you can select anyone. I will go with the PDF standard. And now you can click on download and it will download. Okay, the downloading is started. All right, that's how you can make some amazing slideshow. That's it for today's video. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If something was unable to understand, then you can comment down below us and don't forget to hit the bell icon and thumbs up button. Thank you.